Okay, uh, welcome, Radical Independence. Um, I have to do this video. I have to do it because uh, there's just too much at stake, and I believe that I am just one tiny little commentator out here who is running into the same things that many of my, um, I guess, uh, peers, I don't know, competitors, whatever you want to call them, people who do videos out here, you know, moms, dads, sons, daughters, whoever, people that have uh, channels, people that just one day decided to, to record themselves on their phone and then figured, what the hey, I'm going to upload the video, see if anyone cares. So um, this morning, I do this video, and uh, I have to go out and do some errands, and I come back. And uh, I notice that the video is demonetized. This little symbol, in case you've never seen this before, I figure I will point it out to you. Uh, I have requested a review. I just did that about two minutes before I started rolling the video here. Um, <laughs> look what it says. You'll get a final decision within a week. Can it, can you believe all of, say, now typically they do review these normally within about two days. Okay. But my revenue gets destroyed within those two days because these videos are topical, which means that most people will have moved on from this topic in a couple of days and have no interest in searching out about how uh, Tulsi gets trolled by this TYT commentator who really has no business trolling uh, Tulsi Gabbard. She ought to be trolling the neoliberal candidates that are running, but um, these people are just showing themselves for who they are. So you can see that monetization is on with these other videos. And, you know, I'm not getting tens of thousands of views. If I get four or 5,000 views, it's a big deal for me. So, again, what I'm asking you to do, and I don't typically, you know, beg for money. I'm not PBS, okay? But when you go over to uh, my channel here, and this is my channel, and these are all the, th the things that popped up, okay? There's a link, okay? And you can't kind of see it because it's behind me. <laughs> but on this banner, underneath where my little window is here, let me see if I can move this, uh, and that'll probably show up in the video. Um, there's the link to Patreon, okay? Uh, you can also go to my email address, which again is in the box, description box of this video. And look at that, 340 views, folks, and zero, zero revenue. All right, now I'm thankful for the people that have stuck with me doing this. In addition to all the crap that I get from YouTube doing these videos, in the sense that I'm not really earning that much revenue, uh, my subscriber count has not gone up a whole lot. Okay, it's been stuck right around this number. And I'm grateful that I have almost 7,000 subscribers to this channel. But I'm pointing some things out because they throttle back on you they um, make it so nobody can find content when they're looking for it. They don't make my videos relatable to other videos that have, say, similar viewpoints. Um, maybe it's the word radical. I, I don't know. I have no idea at this point. All I know is that for months this channel was growing and at a fairly good clip for me. Um, not Kim Iverson growth, but, you know, it was growing. And then all of a sudden the growth has, has like stopped. And um, again, view totals vary. I mean, if you look at these uh, views, you're going to see that, you know, some videos, 974 views. They didn't want to hear about virtue signaling. I don't know if it's that people who watch the videos don't like the, the terminology. That's what it was. Um, and again, it varies from video to video. The video I did about Tulsi being canceled which is apparent because if you turn on the, the media, they're constantly trying to find ways to not talk about her. So again, um, if you can help me out, there's the Patreon logo. 
this Patreon account is actually shared. I have a music channel, which actually earns me a lot more revenue than this channel does, uh, because I've been at it for far longer and the videos are less time sensitive than these videos are. But this video is an important video here. Okay, it's an important video and it's disturbing that they would throttle back um, viewership on this and they would basically censor it and say, you know what, we're going to make sure that this guy doesn't do more videos outing people who we believe are in our worldview that, that have the similar uh, view on life that we have. And it, it just, you know, this isn't a partnership. I've said this before. I have no partnership with YouTube. Because if I did, then they would send me an email saying, we saw you did this video. We want to talk to you about it. Um, I, I don't know. Before they would assume the worst of me is if I'm pushing content out that's offensive to their advertisers. Which again, it's like one thing has nothing to do with the other. The video is completely safe for advertisers. The fact that I talk about 9-11, apparently, it, it is a tough subject for a lot of people here on uh, social media, but guess what? It's something we need to talk about. It's not a conspiracy theory to want to take care of the people who were affected by 9-11. Let me say that again. It's not a conspiracy theory, Emma and everybody else, because Tulsi Gabbard wants to take care of people who are affected on 9-11, and our government refuses to do that, number one. And number two, our government refuses to give us uh, an honest assessment of what happened because uh, they failed at every level to protect American citizens. And there's a likelihood that our partnership, our arrangement with Saudi Arabia played a huge role in that. And nobody wants to admit it or talk about it. Uh, it's the greatest tragedy of my lifetime to see those buildings come down. 3,000 plus Americans lost their lives that day. And I just don't understand this. Let just trolling um, Tulsi Gabbard. So anyway, I did this follow-up video because I wanted to show you the stuff that I'm up against as a creator on this platform, which is mind-boggling. The fact that I meet all of their guidelines, I do everything they want me to do, but yet I still get demonetized and lose a huge chunk of my revenue. Plus, again, the channel is being throttled hard, which means they're they're preventing this content from reaching new potential viewers. So you've got to um, share these videos. You've got to um, play the videos, play them over and over. Um, you may want to skip this video until tomorrow if it gets, you know, remonetized. You may want to um, click on the one below that and several that are below that and watch those. Put them on repeat play or something. Put them in a playlist and just keep cycling them. And you don't even have to be in the room. You can walk away. You can do chores, errands, whatever you need to do. Uh, there's got to be a way around this so creators like me can uh, at least sort of break even with the amount of work I'm trying to do here. All right. With that said, I'm done. Um, please support me again. You can do one-time donations and I... Put the address, I'll do it again in the uh, description box of this video for um, one-time PayPal. And again, I showed everyone how to do the Patreon where you can do a monthly support. All is much appreciated. All right, we'll see you soon.